It's very early in the morning and it's biting cold. We're driving to see the sunrise some 13 kilometers away from here. Apologies for the video quality. This video started off uh, in low light conditions, but uh, as you will see as we progress, things get fantastic. The place that we're going to is called Chingeri Mountains. Very nice spot, largely unexplored today, and we hope to be able to scale the summit. Good morning and welcome to another brand new episode of the Cycloids. This morning we're here at Chingeri Mountains. Uh, we took a long while to climb this very arduous peak here. And of course the reward is this breathtaking view. It's fantastic. Down there you see the Karapura River. Uh, it runs across the horizon. Uh, it's more foggy uh, this morning, so you can't actually see as much as you, you probably can during the afternoons. We parked our car near the Chingeri Temple. It's an estimated three kilometers totally for us to be able to get to the summit. We expect to be there in less than an hour, uh, but it's very steep and hard to climb. Incredibly beautiful climb and, and a fantastic view down there. Uh, this is uh, a lifetime experience, I must tell you. And uh, this is exactly why Kerala is called God's Own Country. There is a certain divinity to this place. Uh, no wonder it's called God's Own Country. Uh, it offers such sights and sounds in a lifetime that you can't probably get anywhere else, any place else which is why we're extremely proud and happy to be a part of this very divine land. Uh, down there is the Chingeri temple, the brick red roof that you can see. That's where we parked our car this morning at about 5.30 and began. Up there is, uh, is the, the, perhaps the bigger summit there, the peak there, and uh, we intend to climb that. Uh, we're already a lot exhausted, but uh, why not? What you see there is the phantom rock, named precisely for that reason, looking like a man standing uh, and uh, staring into the horizon. There are many hills in the horizon there. Unfortunately, there's a lot of illicit mining going on uh, here, uh, and that's causing uh, incredible damage to the environment. It's sad that places like these are littered by people who visit here, uh, a heritage site and should be protected and maintained the way it is. Uh, we should not leave uh, any litter. It's sheer wonder how places like this even exist. We discovered this uh, after a long, long search. Uh, it's beautiful, it's pristine, uh, it's one of a kind uh, and truly beautiful to get into. And here we are at last, nearing the summit. I'm dog tired as you can see, panting away to glory. I think we've just climbed 100 meters upwards and there's the sun amidst the clouds. Thankfully, it's not in its full glory, otherwise we'd be swathed in sweat. So we've, we've, we have a bit more to go and we'll see what's on top. Parallel. 
So now, finally, we are on top of the summit. As you can see, it's breathtaking. I don't quite have words to describe the feeling. Uh, it is, in so many ways, such a beautiful place. And we are very lucky to have explored these virgin mountains. I'm sure uh, this place is going to become very popular over the, over the years to come. But uh, our only request to all of you is to be responsible to make sure that you don't litter the place. We've already seen a lot of litter around and that's very, very sad. There's so many people who are waiting to come and explore these beautiful mountains and we should make it a point that they have a pleasant experience as they come on board. It's beautiful breeze up here. Thankfully, uh, we didn't carry much water, but uh, Govind, our friend, carried some amazing black tea for us and that's charged us up. We've got some uh, chocolate bars that we'll be eating up there on the summit. But uh, for now, as you can see, the weather is very, very nice. And uh, that's helping us do the climb effortlessly, I must say. Although it is taking us a huge amount of effort. And if you just pan the camera across, you can see we, are, we feel we're right on top of the world, literally. Unfortunately, we couldn't see the sunrise uh, as we expected. Uh, the weather turned out foggy, but uh, that doesn't matter. And even as, you sp even as I speak right now, uh, you see the fog out there. And uh, in a way, it's good because uh, otherwise we would have uh, been very, very tired uh, making this climb. Uh, but yes, that's the way it is. So that's a glimpse of the civilization that we will eventually be returning to, quite sadly though. Uh, but uh, for now, uh, it's such a beautiful and a divine experience. Uh, we are absolutely thrilled to have been able to do this trek. Uh, I personally never expected to be up here. Uh, and uh, we hope that you like our video. If you do, please don't forget to like, share, and to subscribe to our channel. We'd also love to hear your comments. Uh, so do keep writing to us and we'll be back soon uh, with another video. So long, take care.